Hey guys, it's me Titus and welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I want to share my journey from Guam to to the United States. Okay, so so uh, so if you guys are new to this channel, if any of you don't know where what Guam is, um um, Guam is an island where everybody's friendly, everything's close by, and we have beaches that are never polluted, always clean, and and our traditional Guam food is um, barbecue ribs soaked in soy sauce and onions, and we have red rice and this other traditional Guam dish, which is called Caliguin. It's It's a dish mixed with shredded chicken, shredded coconut and and um and peppers and it's really good and and if you guys go there you're going to love the food there and the food in Guam is really good and in my whole and I grew up and I grew up there and I grew up there I lived in Guam for 14 years but in but in 2016 but in 2016 we moved to Texas and Guam and Guam is is a long long way from from is a long long way from from Texas it from the state it's a well Guam is a long long way from the states and and we so we so so um so the thing is is so when I was um nine I said I wanted to move to the states but we didn't do it and then when i was 12 i wanted to move to the to the states and and we didn't and we and we didn't do it so then one day so that so then one day um when i was so then um when we were going on a trip to visit my brother in hawaii when we were going to hawaii to visit my brother um we thought my parents decided that they wanted to move to texas so so we decided so we so first of all we flew here to tex we in 2015 we after our trip in hawaii we flew from hawaii to texas and we drove from houston to san antonio and we were looking for a house to live here and we didn't find any yet but but because i have some relatives that live here in texas um um they were helping us find a house to live in so so we went back to guam and we spent our last years um and we spent our last year um in guam and then in and then in the new year of of 2016 we we moved to we 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 finally got a new house in texas and we moved we finally got a new house in Texas in here in Texas and and we moved here. So yeah. And and um, my journey and and it was a really long journey from Guam to Texas. And and Guam means a difficult place to get to and it is a long long way from here. It's Guam is located in the North Pacific Ocean next to Hawaii, um, Hawaii, Japan, the Philippines, and Australia. Yeah, um, it's a, it's a long, long way from, it's a long, long way from here. So we're, yeah, so we're like, yeah, so the United States is like far away from Guam. But it's, but Guam is still a nice place and, and it's still my home, my home and, it's still my original home and I and I don't forget where I'm from. And if you guys don't know where you where you're from, it's always good to find out where you're from because it's important to know where you're from because 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 it's sad when people don't know who they are and they don't know where where they come from and 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 that's why it's very important to know where you're from. So I'm originally from Guam and and it was and when I flew from and Guam is a very long way is a very long and 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 
and if you want to fly from, and if you live in Texas, and if you want to drive from, and if you want to fly from, from here, from Texas to Guam, um, it's going to be a really long journey, and, and we had to, and if you're wondering how we, we, um, how we, how, how our trip was really long, so first of all, and when we, after we packed up all our stuff in 20, in 2016, we, we were shipping our, we shipped our stuff here to Texas and, and then we, and then we, um, and then in February, 2016, we, we, we said our last goodbyes to our family and, and then we went, cause our family was at the airport and which is my brothers and sisters and my aunts and my uncles. Yeah, we, um, they, yeah, they came to say their last goodbyes. So we said at the airport, so we said our last goodbyes at the Guam airport. And then we went into, and then we went inside to, to, um, to catch our flight. And, and so we were, so we were gonna, so we flew from, so we flew from Guam to Japan and we had to wait a few hours for for Guam for our flight to Los Angeles cuz we were cuz our flight was booked to to fly from from because our flight was booked to fly from from Guam to Japan to Los Angeles then to Texas so yeah um so when we so when we flew from from Guam we when we flew from when we catched our flight to Japan we flew from Guam to Japan and we waited a few hours in the airport in Japan to wait for our flight to Los Angeles and and it was a real and it was for hours and hours and until like until like the evening like I think it was the late evening we finally our flight finally finally came and we start and then we boarded our flight to to Los Angeles we and then we started boarding our flight to Los Angeles and we and then we flew from and then we flew from Japan to Los Angeles and and um and we landed there which and then we wait and then we landed there the next day yeah cuz cuz we because by the time our flight got to Japan it was late at night it was probably it was evening probably late evening i don't know but but the thing but when we were flying to Los Angeles we we um we landed to Los Angeles the next day and then we waited in the Los Angeles airport and, and, and the thing, and I don't, and I, and the thing is, and when we went to the Los Angeles airport, I didn't know where we were from, but I think we were at an airport where a lot of celebrities land there. I think it was LAX. Yeah. So, so I, yeah, so I think I've been there, but but we um but we landed to Los Angeles and we waited a few hours there and and it was a pretty long and it, and it was a really long journey and well not a really long journey i mean and we waited un until the evening to and then we waited until the evening and then we waited until another evening so we can catch our flight to, to to wait for our flight to um Texas. So we flew from so after we waited a few hours and so after we waited for hours for our flight to Texas, we flew from we the our flight came to came to Gu our flight came to lo landed in Los Angeles around the evening and then we started we boarded our flight and and we landed in Texas in like the middle of in like the middle of the night it was 
it was morning already, but it was still dark when we landed in Texas. So we landed here in Texas um, in the middle of the night. And, and then, and that's how, and then we were staying in a motel for a little while until we got our house. And then finally, after we, and then finally, after we, and then finally, after we bought the house, we were able to go into our house and, and settle in. And, and that's how, and that's, and that's the end of my journey from, from Guam to Lot to Texas. And, and if you, so that's all I wanted to talk about guys. Um, yeah, um, Guam is a really long journey to get, to get to, to get from, to get from here to Guam. And Guam is a very long journey to fly from Guam to the United States because it's, because Guam is like on the other side of the world. And, and just like, and, and you know, the United States is in the other side of the world too. Yeah, so, so we live, so yeah, um, Guam is a very long journey to fly, but, but, but even though it's a long journey to fly, it's still a nice place to get to. And, and, and when you go there, you're going to love all the beaches because the, because the beaches are never, because the beaches in Guam are never polluted. They're always clean. And it's, and it's really like a paradise in Guam. And, and I grew up there since, and I grew up there, lived 14 years in Guam and, and, um, and Guam is very beautiful and it may be like Hawaii, but it's smaller than Hawaii, but it's, but it's not like the States either. Cause Guam is not a state where Guam is a U.S. territory with, um, we're, we're U.S. citizens in Guam, but we're not, but we're not a state. We're, we're like the last U.S. soil. So yeah, um, we're, we're still part of America. Uh, we're still part of America, but, but we're not a state. We're just a U.S. territory. So yeah, um, that's all I wanted to share, guys. So if you guys are new to this channel, please make sure to push please make sure to press that like button and, and the subscribe button in the notification and, and turn on the notifications and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye.